Modern humans with European ancestry share similar skull shapes with Neanderthals who lived tens of thousands of years ago, scientists have found. Researchers discovered that Neanderthal DNA affects the genes of some people of European heritage, making make their heads slightly more elongated. Experts compared casts of Neanderthal skulls with modern human skulls by conducting brain scans of 4,468 people and evaluating their roundness. Variations in DNA affect the expression of two genes that make the brains of some modern humans slightly less round. However, scientists have warned that the difference is minimal and would not be visible to the naked eye. It's a really subtle shift in the overall roundedness, said Dr. Philip Gunz, from the Max Planck Institute for Evolutionary Anthropology in Germany, who conducted the research. I don't think you would see it with your naked eye. These are not people that would look Neanderthal-like. Dr. Guns and two colleagues set out to determine why this was and how the rounded brain shape of modern humans gradually evolved. The team set out to identify DNA variants that contributed to humans' rounded brains, and made an educated guess that some Neanderthal DNA might affect brain shape and make it more elongated. To confirm their theory, they first analyzed brain scans from 4,468 people of European ancestry and measured their overall roundness. Then, they cross-referenced whether any of the 50,000 Neanderthal DNA fragments, known in some modern humans were linked with the difference in their brain shape. Comparing the lists of figures led the team to a specific pair of known Neanderthal fragments, which appear to determine the degree of skull roundness. Dr. Guns and his team were able to pinpoint variants near two genes, WBR4 and PHLPP1. UBR4 has a role in making nerve cells used in deep structures within the brain, called the basal ganglia. PHLPP1 is involved in insulating nerve cells in what's known as a myelin sheath. Neanderthal variants of both of these genes affect the brain's development, and account for the elongated shape detected in some modern Europeans. Neanderthal DNA variations alter gene expression in brain regions involved in planning, coordination and learning of movements. There is no indication that they affect brain function in modern humans, although the discovery points to biological changes that might have given the human brain its shape. Scientists say the brain reached its current structure between 35,000 and 100,000 years ago. Roughly 1% of European genes originate from interbreeding with Neanderthal populations. The earliest human fossils from across Africa date back to 200,000 to 300,000 years ago and had large yet elongated brains. The full findings of the study were published in the journal Current Biology.